Morning in Style with David Caruso, brought to you by St. Kate, the Arts Hotel. And today we have the place to go to celebrate the holidays and how to make a stay out of it by including a magnificent hotel experience. David Caruso is live at St. Kate this morning with more. What's up, David? Good morning, Molly. I just want to give a quick shout out to Tiff. I know this is one of her favorite places and we just happen to be surrounded by the color blue here. So thinking of them and we are looking forward to the holidays here at the St. Kate. It is the most stylish place in town to celebrate the holidays with your family and friends. There is literally so much to do here. There are galleries, restaurants, bars. It is right in the heart of downtown with easy parking and just for today, Molly, our friends at Interior Scapes kind of added a little of my favorite razzle dazzle to get us in the holiday spirit. I absolutely love that, David. Thank you so much, too, for the shout out to Tiff. I know she really appreciates. Love seeing all that blue there, too. So, should we start then by talking about the holiday marketplace? Absolutely. I have a fabulous friend here. Renee Bebo is the coordinator of the Holiday Marketplace, which is happening right here at St. Kate on December 10th and 11th from 11 to 4 o'clock. Renee, good morning. Good morning. So you have told me that the Holiday Marketplace is the event this holiday season. And what can guests expect to experience here? Um, well, there's going to be over 125 artists filling this hotel on the first floor and the second floor, the Arc theater, the Simone Ballroom upstairs, um, any kind of unique gift that you can find. And that's what's really so neat about this marketplace is that it is filled with artists and there's lots of different kinds of art from jewelry to oil paintings, right? Yes, exactly. All kinds of things, knitted things, leather things, wooden things, ornaments. I mean, you name it, you know, and it's all handmade by local artists, which is the unique thing. That is so special. And price points, too. Something for everybody? Something for everyone. Five to ten dollars. I mean, prints and cards up to, like you said, mini oil paintings or, you know, even clothing and things for your pet. Wow, that's so cool. And I was here last year and had such a fun time. Mm -hmm. But like you said, guests can experience so much more because now it is also upstairs. It's basically double the size from last year. Yes, we doubled it and brought so much here for everyone to see. So basically, we can all kind of come here and get our Christmas shopping done on one day in one place, right? Literally, <laughs> literally. Yes, you can find something for everyone. That's so great. Absolutely. And uh, like you said, all local artists. So it yes. really is a community event. And what are some of your favorite things to do here at the St. Kate besides enjoy the art? Well, there's uh, galleries full of art and art throughout the hallways as well. As you come through to see the artists, there's extra. And um, well, there's Giggly upstairs. You can get a drink. I mean, you can have a wine while you're shopping. That's so cool. And one more thing, what is Kate's Curiosities? Is that a part of the marketplace this year? Well, it'll be open and there's all kinds of gift items in there as well that are here all year round. Nice. So. Mm -hmm. Great. So thank you so much for joining us. I will see you again at the marketplace, but make sure everybody to join us and Renee at the marketplace December 10th and 11th right here at St. Kate. Molly, it's just a really great place to buy some good gifts. Oh, I know it is, David. And that's such a fun thing. I love how she mentioned the you can have a glass of wine as you shop. So the whole thing is, is an experience for sure. Speaking of that, I want to talk about something that's going on a little bit later than the marketplace, and that is brunch with Santa. That's got to be a family favorite. Wow, brunch with Santa. This is going to be so much fun also. And like you said, perfect for families happening December 17th and 18th. They do have reservations, seatings at 8.30 and 11 o'clock. This is in the most festive ballroom here at the hotel. Great food, unbelievable sweets, actually from another local bakery, confectionately yours. And what's neat about this is the kids can take photos with Santa's. They can write letters to Santa. There's crafts that they can do. So it really is going to be the place to make holiday lifelong family memories, memories having brunch with Santa. Really a great time for everybody. Oh, for sure. And in that picture, that looked like about the hippest, coolest Santa I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> um, I want to talk about something else that I think is great for families or couples to consider, and that is dinner out. And actually at Aria, aren't they doing dinner on Christmas Eve as well as a, a meal on uh, Christmas Day? 
Yes, they are. And Aria is just a beautiful place here on the second floor of the hotel. And it is one of the most wonderful places for a special date night or taking somebody special. And they are literally having Christmas dinner on December 24th and 25th. Uh, it is all the comforts of a home-cooked Midwestern meal, and they have special menus, really, really great. And you can also enjoy New Year's Eve in Aria on December 31st, and for that, they have a really special enhanced New Year's Eve menu. So Aria is also going to be a hopping place. Fantastic. I love Giggly. This is a place I love to go with girlfriends. Um, it's really Milwaukee's only champagne bar, but they've got some great things going on for New Year's too, don't they? They do, and like you said, Milwaukee's only champagne bar. It is so much fun. New Year's Eve packages where you can reserve a table for you and your most favorite people with champagne, party favors, dessert, or charcuterie. So much fun there. And you can start the new year on New Year's Day in Giggly as well with bubbles and brunch. I mean, it can't get any more fun than that. And there are endless Bloody Marys and mimosas. So much fun to start the new year right up at Giggly. Love it. All right, we ran out of time, but want to mention really quick, I know in the bar, the lobby there, on New Year's Eve, they've got live music, they've got party favors, they're doing a champagne toast. And real quickly, the other thing that people should know about is that you can make a staycation out of it because it is the place to be. To be. So I'm sure they're encouraging people to make reservations. Absolutely, we are here in the lobby and the bar is just over there. There's fun entertainment here all the time. And like you said, it's the perfect place for a staycation, but make sure for holidays, you make your reservations. I'll okay. see you here, Mal. All right, sounds good. I love it, David. Beautiful there, already decorated for the holidays, which is fantastic. And all of the holiday events we talked about today are listed on the holiday page at stkatearts.com.